We were doing so well. We were doing so well, guys. One of the biggest companies on Earth did something truly incredible. Some said it was a spectacle. Some said it was the biggest spectacle since the moon landing. It was brilliant. YouTube finally decided to take ads off Logan Paul videos. And the world rejoiced. It was amazing. We were all happy. We were all delighted. Um, then there was also this really expensive SpaceX live stream car commercial thing. That was pretty neat, too. But then, then, I discovered this. I got some very sad, sad news. Um, So... Dave Chappelle's cousin is saying that Dave Chappelle is a clone. Yeah, he just dropped an absolute bomb on us, guys. Dave Chappelle is a clone. And I know what you're thinking. Nelly, why are you bringing attention to these dumb people? There's probably like 20 people that watch this video. And this video is heavily disliked. And I'm sure the comments are just like completely criticizing it. And wow, do I have some more bad news for you guys. Yeah, this video has 600 plus thousand views. Um, very good like to dislike ratio. The comments just completely ignore anything stupid that's been said in this video and they just applaud it. Yeah, man, this makes sense. I, I've always thought Dave Chappelle was a clone. So let's jump into the rest of this video. This, this is not a joke or a laughing matter or anything to be desensitized. Wait, what? What did, what did you just say? He desensitized. He desensitized. He desensitized. Ah, okay, that's what I thought. Desensitized? Okay, cool. Very cool. And because people want to control the people through these people, now these people is dead. People want to control these people through these people. That's why these people is dead. Absolute wordsmith. All of us got to figure out some way to stop this. There's billions of us, probably trillions of us on this planet, and we can do something about it if we truly try to. It's supposed to be on the underground. It's somewhere underneath the planet, somewhere where they're cloning these people. There you have it. There's our Toyota Corolla backseat vlog hero. He doesn't know how to solve the problem. He knows there's trillions of people on Earth that, that could probably solve this underground society of cloning. He just, he's just looking for help, guys. So he's going to show you this great little uh, podcast that I can't seem to find any information on. It's literally, this uh, video has the only, like, copy of this podcast. I have no idea where he found it. But let's let's see what the podcast is about. Because we can make fun of this guy for days. But we got to get to the core of this video. And she is the family member, the first cousin of actor and comedian Dave Chappelle. And um, she is here to uh, regale us with the facts regarding what happened to Dave Chappelle. Um, from the time that, you know, uh, he walked away from his Comedy Central show to, uh, to now. Um, but she wishes to have her voice remain anonymous. So her voice will be distorted to keep her um an amenity an amenity an amenity a manatee wait does anyone in this video know how to speak english this is honestly troubling that there's this many people that don't know how to speak english i would like to uh talk about someone who who was very dear to me and all right just gotta stop it right here for a quick second as someone that's edited podcasts this absolutely triggers me the fact that they kept her little i fucking can't stand it first of all and this lady takes 35 minutes to explain something that would take the normal person five seconds. It's absolutely ridiculous. And I can't believe I sat through this entire video or most of it for that matter. And well, nobody that, you know, any of us, we know that Oprah is one of the queen bees, dark bees of the Illuminati. Like all great conspiracy theories, you got to tie it in with other celebrities. So obviously Oprah is already in the Illuminati. She's already in the inner circle, as this person says. And yeah, she she made Dave Chappelle come on the show. Um, and she's like, yeah, bro, you want to get cloned? Why don't you take that 50 million deal that, uh, why don't you take that 50 million dollars that Comedy Central offered you? You want you want to get cloned, buddy, and get killed? Didn't think so. She, she tried to scare him into joining the Illuminati, guys. That's clearly what happened uh, on that interview. But David was receiving threatening letters he, re he received a package in the mail um it was bill cosby and there it is bill cosby is also now in this story that this crazy person has made up isn't isn't that crazy isn't that crazy guys bill cosby sent dave Chappelle a letter saying hey man you better join the goddamn illuminati or we're gonna clone you we're gonna do it and it was almost at this point i'd turn it off but here's the actual breaking point where i just i just couldn't listen to it anymore but they show um uh bernie mac uh the cloning uh, lab and uh when bernie mac came forth came back and told uh uh steve harvey and dl Hughley and and a few others and uh you know that he saw the cloning lab and that uh something had to be done to stop that 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 that, that, this, that foolishness of what they were doing well steve harvey and dl Hughley went back and told 
the top brass of the Illuminati, the dog circle, in a dog, dog circle, and what they did, they killed him. Okay, so now let's go, let's go back to David Chappelle. Whoa, 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 whoa. You can't just drop that in the middle of an hour and a half podcast and have a two-minute segment where you just confirm that Bernie Mac died because he saw the cloning labs. How dare you? Um, first of all, like I feel like a five-year-old taking this thing apart. Like It's just so bad. Why didn't they clone Bernie Mac? If they have the ability to kill someone and clone them, why didn't they do it to Bernie Mac? Bernie Mac was very successful in making a lot of people a lot of money, so I don't get why they wouldn't do that. But let's just take a step back. Even if this person is like 100% telling the truth, uh, Dave Chappelle is their cousin, Dave Chappelle told them about the cloning stuff, let's just say both of those things are true. How the hell do you know Ber uh, Bernie Mac died because of this? I mean, you're just pulling shit out of your ass. She's literally taking like random parts of the internet, random articles, random videos, and tied it to fit this little narrative. We could take this thing apart for days. There's other parts where she says uh, Martin Lawrence is a clone, and she just drops that in a one-liner. Just in a one-liner. Oh, yeah, by the way, Martin Lawrence is a clone, guys. Or we can talk about the fact that she says cloning takes two hours. First of all, you're not a scientist. Second of all, if we could clone people in two hours, I would at least hope we're doing something bigger and better than that. But the reason I chose this video as opposed to other videos is because this video is like a reference. It's a source. If this was Scientology, this would be the first book. It's all over the internet, and people are taking it as the word of God. It's amazing. So let's explore this dark, dark rabbit hole. All right, so here we are in another Dave Chappelle Illuminati clone video. So some signs that you're in a quality video. Um, you're looking for all caps in the titles. Uh, you're looking for a old David and a new David in the thumbnail, so like a clone Dave Chappelle. Um, you're looking for someone that doesn't know how to pick the right font with the background. Uh, you're looking for someone that doesn't know how to pick a background. And then if, it, if they have some cringy, like dramatic music, that also helps. Looking at these comments, this is why I love the internet. Um, the number one comment on this video, Dave's cousin that he was very close comma to, oh my god no one in this community knows how to spell that comma is completely out of place it triggers me anyways it revealed that dave disappeared after a meeting and eight years later this fake dave popped up dave never contact contacted his cousin again my god they've taken that video that was blatantly fucking awful and wrong and just hilarious and they're using that now as the definitive proof and they're spreading it around the internet and everyone in the comments agreed with them clearly 74 upvotes or likes so that's absolutely fantastic. And then let's look at a second comment. As an artist, I can look at Dave's eyebrow and see how it is more open in the center. And the brow itself even has more of an arc to it. <laughs> Stop that. Stop that. We've got an eyebrow expert out here. This is amazing. Um, and then this is scary. I knew it when I first seen him. <laughs> yeah, you, you looked at Dave Chappelle when he came back and the first thing you thought, yeah, this guy's a clone. And then uh, another one comment. This is the reason Bernie Mac died. My God, people. My God. Stop that. Stop that. It's, I mean, these comments are so hilarious. And it's funny how, like, one false, you know, one piece of misinformation, one piece of, like, really, really poorly put together um, stories and facts can just translate and spread throughout the internet. But, yeah, hope you enjoyed our exploration of one of the weirdest rabbit holes I've been in quite some time. Desensitized.